Welcome to Podman Podcast, uh, the merriest pod, er, <laughs> the wow. merriest pipe band podcast. How embarrassing! I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a, uh, it's just such a festive time. Yeah. yeah. If you're if you're listening to us on your earbuds, uh, you probably don't know that we're sitting in a parking lot right now. Yes, with Christmas lights. Yeah, and our drums. Yeah, or if you're listening, you probably do know because there are parking lot noises. Yes. Like that. We're in a parking lot <laughs> in downtown Mesa. Um, we At just, Mary Main Street. Yeah. You don't know what that is, probably. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> we just got done playing a concert um, on Main Street, and it's called Mary Main Street. Yes. Because it's very merry. It's a good time. It's Christmas. It's merry, and it's on Main Street. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we're going to talk a little bit about our experience, about the merriest of... Of Main Streets. Of Main Streets, and... <laughs> Probably a little bit of, like, what we look forward to next year, I guess, at the end here. Yeah. This is going to be our Christmas episode. Yay! Yay! No Mountain Dew this year. Sorry. Or, Sorry. no, that was or, New Year's. Yeah, that was, that was, that was New, New Year's. Year's. That's Happy right. New Year. There's By still the way, time. Um, there is still time. If you'd like to take our New Year's challenge, <laughs> <laughs> what you, what you got to do, do the do. Do the do. What you got to do. And um, we're telling you about this at Christmas so you can have a couple weeks to prepare. Mm-hmm. Go to your nearest convenience store or wherever you purchase your soft drinks. Buy as many flavors of Mountain Dew as you can. Um, and then go home and take a sip of Dew. And for each different flavor, you have to come up with one thing that you would like to be different or better in the new year. And in the new year. In the new year. Yes. And that is Merry Dew Year. Um, that's how we celebrate the Dew Years here at Pipe Band Podcast. <laughs> we had pod, an episode about band. that. <laughs> <laughs> It's, it's a mess. Just, it's a mess. It's a mess. Someone's smoking something back there, and I think the something the, the you know the fumes are kind of getting to us. I don't know. Um, but yeah, we listen. We uh, we had that episode last year around the new year, and sure, we had a bunch of things that we wanted to change. Did they change? I don't know. Go back and listen to it. I don't think so. <laughs> Who knows? Who can say? If only there was some way to know. If only. Anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah, the gig we just played. Yes. The uh, the gig we just played. Yes. <laughs> We're here. In the um, parking lot of the gig yeah. we just played. There was like a, they have like down the street, they have like a big Christmas tree. This is our downtown in downtown Mesa. They have a big Christmas tree down there. Um, and uh, some vendors here at a this, they call it the Christmas market. I guess that's a thing that they do or used to do in European countries where they have like a yeah. bunch of like. There's some in Paris. I remember looking those up. Oh, nice. So, yeah. Yeah. We have one here. And there's... It's very small. Oh. <laughs> and there's a stage where <laughs> they have live music and uh, performances. And we were one of the performers. Yes. We were one of the live music. One of... We were some live music. <laughs> <laughs> and it was a good time. Yeah. Yeah. And then we also had the Co- U.S. Coast Guard pipe band. Yes, the Coast Guard. Not pipe band, not pipe band. band. U.S. Coast Guard Auxiliary. 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 Okay, we had this (laughs) discussion. That word is spelled auxiliary. Yes. But it's pronounced auxiliary, I guess. That's the English language. I don't know if every time I try to pronounce it, I like see the word in my brain and I'm like auxiliary (laughs) and then everyone laughs at me. So um, it's okay. I mispronounce things all the time. That's okay. We all do. Yeah. Who's to say what's the right way to pronounce something? Yeah. Um, so yeah, sorry if there's some traffic noises or whatever in the background. There is traffic. But we're in a parking lot, like I said. <laughs> you gotta parking do- Parking lot special. Yeah. That's what we'll call it. Christmas parking lot special. There we go. There. You were here when we came up with that name. <laughs> Congrats. Yeah. I bet you feel special now. Maybe we'll cut that and put that only for the patrons. <laughs> yes. Patreon exclusive. Um, yeah, so- well, let's oh. the show. Yes, yes. Let's pull up the schedule. Yeah. Mac. I can't pull up the schedule. Oh, because it's on your phone. I can phone's right the there. <laughs> you know, I got a new phone finally. Oh, that's exciting. Because my previous phone was from like 2016. It still had buttons. <laughs> it still had a home button and everything. And um, it worked fine, but it was also like really, really slow. And I don't like, I don't know anything about phones, but it started to get pretty pretty slow um and i looked up stats on like new phones and it was like oh you can get you know 128 uh 
gig phone and I was like, what is mine now? And I looked it up and it was like 34. 34? Yeah. And I'm like, that's why I have to delete pictures all the time because I have no memory. I have like two something on my phone and then I have a 500 gig SD card in it. Jeez. Yeah. No, this one is like better. It's, I was like, I don't need a top of the line phone, you know, but like is better than. Anything's better than what you had. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, anyway, so let's recap. Let's recap. So we, we formed up, um, in the middle of the markets, in the middle of the Christmas market, people were trying to buy things and we're like, um, no. we're a pipe band. Yeah. <laughs> Get out of the way. <laughs> Move. <laughs> um, okay. So the Coast Guard auxiliary band was set up on stage. Uh, they're a brass band. So they had brass and, and a drum set yep. and all that. And, uh, we formed up like further away. And then we played Green Hills, Battles Over, on the move. Mm -hmm. We marched. By the right. Quick march. <laughs> and we quick marched all the way up to the front of the stage. Um, the, so the thing is, when we do gigs like this, they usually have a stage. Because we've done a few things like this. Mm -hmm. We can never go on the stage because we're always too big. That and like, We've been on stage. We've been on stage a couple times. But then it's like you got to march up the stairs. And that, that stage shouldn't seem very safe after watching the dancers on it. <laughs> we'll get to that. Yes. <laughs> Uh, so we formed up in front of the stage, um, played Sky Boat Song. Mm -hmm. That was good. That's a crowd pleaser. So the things we name, these are not hard tunes. They're not meant to impress you. This this is just what our, we did. This is our repertoire. And like, it's not hard to put on a show. If your pipe band wants to do it, you can do it. Learn easy these peasy. tunes. They're easy. Learn other tunes. I don't care. <laughs> you do you. You don't have to play hard music to put on a good show is what I'm trying to say. Um which was good because we had a lot of like newer players, people who have never um, played in a gig like this before because they just started learning and like it's the middle of the pandemic. So yeah, it's been like two <laughs> years of off season pretty much. Yeah. So it's like, we promised you'll get to play a gig eventually. And this was the eventually. Yes. Congrats. Yeah. So after Sky Boat Song, um, we played Roses of Prince Charlie and You Jacobites by Name. Mm -hmm. That's a fun set. That's, that's a good one. Yeah. That's a good one. Um, then there was a Highland Dance. Yes, that was a good one. That was a good one. That was the little tiny kids. I didn't get footage of that one. I'm so sorry, everyone. Aww. I got footage of the older ones. Sorry, patrons. Oh, by the way, if you're listening to this and you want the footage of us sitting in a parking lot <laughs> and also... It's festive footage, by the way. Look at the is, thumbnail. There's lights and... Drums. Um, drums. Hats. There's uh, footage of the concert, which, mm -hmm. yes. which we got. Uh, and you'll get to see that if you... If, 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 mm -hmm. if mm -hmm. you sign up on patreon.com, P-A-T-R-E-O-N.com slash podbandpipecast. I'm not going to spell that out because that's too many letters. Uh, but <laughs> for the low, low price of $5 Plus tax. per month, you can see this video footage and all the other video footage of all of our other episodes. And early access to those video footages. Yes. If you're a true Podband Pipecast fan and you want your episodes... A few days early, just sign up. Yeah, do you it. Got it. Yeah, yeah. So anyway, um, <laughs> that was cute. The little, the little dancer. Uh, so small. So so teeny tiny. Um, for the uh, the Arizona Academy of Highland Dance. Um, shout out to Elizabeth Rich and her uh, crew there. She's the teacher, and then she has a bunch of dancers that she instructs, and we partner with them on a few gigs where. We think it would be fun to have dancers. And it was fun. It was fun. It was super cute. Um, I know one was her daughter and the other two were the daughters of Cody, who's our drum sergeant, my nieces. They were uh, four and three. So. So small. It's so tiny. Imagine how cute that is. Um, You're going to have to imagine it, though, because I, I didn't get footage of it. Oh, that's so sad. So. Well, that's, I mean. Sorry. Use your imagination. <laughs> that's what it's there for. It was cute. Uh, yeah. And by the way, all of us wore our Christmas attire, ugly sweaters, yes. Santa hats, um, as Christmas many lights. Christmas yes. lights as we could. And the little girls, uh, when they were dancing, they just had like their Christmas sweaters and Christmas socks and it, their dance and shoes. They had lights in their hair, too. It was fun. Yeah, it was super or cute. Or the older girls did. Yeah. Yeah. The younger ones, I don't know. They just, they're just like, they go had up there and dance. And it was <laughs> yeah. cute. Go up there and hop a little bit. Yeah. So they were on the stage doing that. Um, and then after that, we did... Oh, the brass band played. Mm -hmm. A lot of Christmas music. It was good. Lots. I don't remember the, all the songs, but pretty much any Christmas song they played. Um, Even the Christmas song. Yes. The 
Christmas song. It's not a Christmas song. And then there was another dance. Mm-hmm. Um, that one was... I don't remember what that one was, but that was where the older girls were on the stage dancing. And <laughs> the stage is like a, a truck trailer, it's, like a big trailer. Yeah, with like a fold out stage kind of thing. And it was big enough to hold the brass band and the couple dancers. And the lights. And don't the, forget there the were lights. lights. There were lights on the stage. And as the dancers were dancing, they have so much force behind their dancing that it like wiggled the lights a lot there was a lot of light wiggling and we were all just like standing there because the pipe band is not playing during this time it's a solo piper and the dancers and we're watching and we're just like is it gonna be okay so some some of us grabbed the lights and we're like holding them (laughs) as they're dancing and luckily it wasn't one of those dances where they like move around too much they were just like jumping you know um so yeah then they finished with that, and luckily it was all okay. Yes. Um, <laughs> no mishaps with the lights. No. Very close, but it was okay. Um, and then we ca- we uh, did another few tunes. So another thing we do when we when we have concerts like this is, like, if you have, like, an hour of a show that you're playing at one of these events and you're booked for an hour, um, typically we don't just play, 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 play. Um this one, we obviously partnered with the dancers and the brass band, so they switched off with us. Um, but also we had Kevin Conquest, shout out to Kevin, uh, narrating, or I don't know what you want to call it. Emceeing. M- seeing And like just kind of giving some background to some of the tunes, because people love that stuff. Like, it's, so think about like from another, if you're another band and you're playing a cover of like, a Metallica song. It's like, oh, this is a Metallica song. And like, that's all you really need to say about it. Right. Um, some songs have interesting history behind them. And so with pipe band, a lot of our songs have interesting history. So Kevin kind of gave a little bit of like background behind each of the tunes. And that like helps. I don't want to say fill time, but like, but it helps fill time. It helps fill time. <laughs> bagpipes are a lot. An hour of bagpipes. Like oof. it's a lot. It's just like, and as a, as a person, who's attending this you don't like they don't listen to bagpipes all the time so it kind of all starts to sound the same (laughs) so it's good to have some breaking up of between there people understand like oh this is a different song because this one is uh the next set we played was um pikeman's march dawning of the day um which once again are like their marches right so like it everything we played thus far is pretty much a march except for skyboat song yeah <laughs> so it's like you gotta you gotta make it kind of unique for the people who don't really know what they're listening for um and then we played highland cathedral after that classic i did not know the fun fact that kevin gave about it that I it being not. written by german tourists i did not know that yeah that was interesting see it's not just for the crowd yeah i learn all kinds of things too when he talks <laughs> i'm like wow um <laughs> that they wrote it for the glasgow cathedral which i've been to and it's it's very beautiful I guess we didn't go there the last time because we were in Edinburgh. Yeah. But the last, last time that we went, um, yeah, it was in Glasgow. We went there, and it was it was beautiful. So that was nice. Once again, pro tip, break up your your sets. If your band can only play marches, <laughs> learn a couple slow airs. You know, Highland Cathedral's a good one. Skyboat's a good one. Um, Amazing Grace is a good one. We Always that a classic. Later, but, like, break it up. Bye, Todd. <laughs> shout Todd. out to Todd shout out to Todd driving by um, maybe you can hear the engine of his it's loud car is that a, a charger no That's idea a, I don't know it's a blue it's a blue car what's, what's your I'm car? sorry Todd. Todd yeah he's gonna yell at us on the <laughs> Patreon <laughs> yeah Todd's a patron so shout out to him I'm sure he will comment on our post on Patreon mm, what his car is yeah. okay we're trying Tell to get it fact checked but Alex we, says we it's know. a Dodge Charger so Todd Alex knows you yeah if, if, he's, if we're wrong it's his fault yeah <laughs> <laughs> anyway pro tip like I said break up your March sets with just some slow airs every once in a while um, and then we played Killy Cranky Battle of Waterloo mm-hmm. once again marches those are fun lots of marches brass band played some more Christmas music um and then there was another dance. This one was a chantreuse, which they did in front of the stage because it's one where they like fling around a bunch. And the the stage is not safe. No, for it the is, flinging. was not safe for all of that flinging. <laughs> um, and then solo piper. So Elijah, shout out to Elijah. 
Yes. He was on a couple of our episodes, I believe. Uh, the episode called The Dance Piper, I believe, was the first one because he was the one who was playing for all the dance sets. Um, he played some Christmas music, which was interesting because, you know, bagpipe Christmas music, not all the notes are what you think they should be. But it works. It works. I got a little bit of footage of that, too. So good. here it is. Did you like that? Nice. <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't hear that or didn't see that. Here it is again. There you go. <laughs> All right. I don't know why you missed it the first time. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, now the brass band came back on and they played... Um, more Christmas music, right? More Christmas music. And then they played their service anthems, which is... Was was pretty fun. Like the crowd always likes that kind of thing. There, so the the U.S. military has a different song for each um, branch of the military. Sure, I didn't uh, know that. So you didn't that know was, that? No, I didn't know that. Well, so there you go. So they do a thing where they play like first they play the army song, and whenever there's people in the crowd who are a veteran or in the armed forces, they'll stand up when their song is being played, and then everyone's like, "Oh, look, we're happy for you. Thank so, you for your service." Yeah. So, um, yeah. That was fun. Mm -hmm. And then all of us, all together, played Amazing Grace. So once again, breaking it up with some crowd pleasers. And then um, there was Scotland the Brave. Brave. 42nd uh, yes. Highlanders and Scotland the Brave. So what we did is the pipe band started, played 42nd Highlanders. And then the brass band came in at Scotland the Brave. And then we repeated the set. And on the repeat of the set, we started marching and we marched out. We started morphing into a blob and then we marched out <laughs> so this is the other thing that i always think is hilarious pipe bands i guess our pipe band i assume other pipe bands too we're just we just kind of go with the flow yeah yeah how we practice the marching in our rehearsal doesn't always translate to how it actually goes yeah but we just do it it's like you know where your ranks are and like you just you'll, you'll fall into place at some point yeah and yeah. you do it and it ended up looking okay, I like to think. But I don't know. Did you get footage of this? I did not. Okay, I was well, in it. I was in the blob. That's a good point. <laughs> well, you'll never know if it looked good or not. It looked fantastic. That's how it looked. That, of course. Take our word for it. We saw. <laughs> so, yeah. That was our concert. Um, yeah. Yeah. It was up about it. No, it was about 45 minutes, probably. Yeah, we didn't take up the full hour, which yeah. was good, because apparently there was someone else that was supposed to be on in the middle of our set. So, <laughs> You know when these things, like these community events happen, and they just kind of... Everyone goes with the flow. Yeah, they just happen. Um, you know, people are here having a good time, drinking hot chocolate, making making some schmoes. Schmoes? <laughs> <laughs> it's a Toy Story joke. I haven't seen Toy Story in a while. Wow, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to... S'mores. Thank you. <laughs> Don't be a schmo. There's apparently a food truck forest down there. Um, I kind of want to go check it out after this. Yeah. I think I will. I think we yeah. will. Tell, while I'm telling us. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get some footage of it. Yes. Check, out, check it out. Wow, Great. look at that. This, doesn't that look great? Oh, I could go for some of that. Yeah. That too. Wow. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> Tasty. I did, though... <laughs> Before we started, uh, Sean brought me a lobster roll that he got at the food truck forest, and it was a pretty good lobster roll. That's good. Yeah. Look at all that food. It looks tasty. I think we'll get this. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, uh, yeah, we're going to finish up with uh, Happy New Year. Happy New Year's. Happy New Year. Tell us what you wished for with your Mountain Dew challenge. <laughs> I wish for more Highland Games. I wish for new shoes because mine have a hole in them. <laughs> I'm not wearing them because there's like oh. a hole like right in that spot. Really? Yeah. Oh, that's sad. Yeah. So Santa, bring Adela some new shoes. <laughs> Please Santa, thanks. <laughs> and happy New Year's uh, challenge. I'm, I'm going to say that we're going to have more Highland Games this year. That's what I would like to change. And then... Um, we're just we're just gonna they're gonna have a good time. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Uh, there probably won't be episodes for the next couple of weeks because we're on vacation. Yep. It's the holidays. Hope you have a happy holiday. Um, days. Days. That that word means a different thing in the UK. You know, holiday. You're oh, going on yes. Holiday. Yes. We are going on holiday, and it is the holidays, right? So. So would it be? It would be days. Hey, days. 
Happy Daisies. Daisies. Okay. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Merry Happy Christmas. New Year's. Happy Bye. Happy New Year's. Bye. Bye. Thanks for listening, everyone. If you enjoyed this show, then support us on Patreon for exclusive content as well as the video of us recording this. We'll have special exercises we'll be writing as well as tips and tricks with tenor drumming and other instruments to come. Um, subscribe to us on YouTube for some tenor tutorials and possibly other tutorials later on. Um, and like us on Facebook at Podband Podcast.